For a 4S H hose, you will need to do the external skive using the same process as preparing a 4SP hose. However, the 4S H hose is also required to be internally skived. This is known as interlock. Always perform the external skive first as this will make the internal one easier. This is done in a similar way to external skiving. Firstly find the skive length on the swage chart or the technical catalogue provided by the hose manufacturer. Now select the correct mandrel for the size of hose you are using. The length and height of the skive are adjusted using the grub screws in the back and sides of the mandrel. When skiving the internal length be sure to run the skiver in reverse otherwise you will be going against the braid which could unwind the rubber liner and the wire braid of the hose. When skived, you should have a clean finish and again be able to see the wire but not have cut into it. Be certain to clean this before inserting the fit in as this is a potential contaminant that could work its way into the assembly. Again, once you are happy with this, you may proceed to swaging the hose.